Oh god. <laughs> oh no. Looking down TV escape. Fucking hell. Not not where I like to be. Just quietly. Now you get the wizard first. Maybe splash out for a babe. He's got a roger, so definitely gonna get a babe. He's got claw mighty blow, he's got a block roger. He's got Adge Wrestle Strip. Go fuck yourself. I'm just going to get fucked. The wizard doesn't even do anything. Wrestle Strip, Adge 5. Do you know what? It's time. It's time for the secret. The secret weapon. And... Babe or uh, extra apple. Extra apple, then I can apple an early KO. Your hands in it. <laughs> oh, I didn't look at his record, but um, his team looks a fucking beast of a team anyway. Right, learn from my mistakes, protect the ball at all costs. No. Good old Ludi. And he's being a clever dingo and choosing to defend. So already I guess he's got a good record with his team. Looks like it's going to be a loss then, eh? He's 7 and 0. Alright, you're just guessing. <laughs> oh, he had 7 fan factor. Yeah. Yeah, well, Joe Mandy's like tabletop, isn't he? That's the thing. And just always playing tabletop tournaments is a bit different. Right, fucking loot group, let's go. Why, why is he, he even there? I don't know. 2D him, 2D him, 2D him, blitz him. Hope for the fucking best. Four, two, one. All right, thank you, BDO. Oh, God. He's got Fan Factor 7. So, take a pitch invasion and lose. Seems good. Seems fair. Seems whimsical.
this loot pack didn't go down. I mean loot grip. Okay, just run forward. At least he got three down actually. He got four down. No, three down. Three down from the thing. So it was three versus four, which wasn't that bad. But it's still fucking bad. On offense against Skaven, 400 TV down. You know, that's pretty, that's pretty shit. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, this given team is is pretty disgusting. TBH fans. Anyway, I'm going to get some dinner. Right, um, cutting it fine here. Yeah? All right, well, at least he didn't. No, he fouled. Nobody died though. That's something. I just want to get get this sorted. Number one, isn't it? <laughs> Extreme couple of GFIs. Don't want to give up a mighty blow block, do I? Right, hopefully this is good enough. Anyway, right, I'm eating me dinner now, so uh, yeah, I am AFK, yeah. Um, right, yeah. I've got 13 players, so I probably should try to foul his guy if I ever get him down.
Well, to be fair, Shatter Dice, um, he did get the uh, pitch invasion to let him do this. Otherwise, he wouldn't have been making fouls on my best player. That was just bollocks that got the fucking pitch invasion. Pretty annoying. Oh shit, I am muted. Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> Chicken thighs, actually. Nom, nom, nom.
No, I told Vino and Dad when I was away there. Twelve six. Wow, Destronov, you are either incredibly rich or incredibly stupid. <laughs> <laughs> and I mean that in the nicest possible way because you need a hell of a bankroll for that to not be stupid right, pow him and two dice the roger and then make a cage of three players. That doesn't really work, does it? There's no way to even get out of this. Blitz him, then dodge away, I guess, is the only... Is the only everyone getting fucking stunned is no, no, no good, is it? Oh god, I went too far. Alright, good for me. Alright, so I don't need the, the corner there. Three stuns. Huge. Limits. Oh, you don't mean 12 six as the blinds, you mean 12 tables of six men. All right. I only played four tables at once, but I only had one fucking screen. Now I've got two screens, I would try playing eight tables. But, um... Yeah. I mean, that's the thing, isn't it? You don't really have much choice about the fucking... Star of Steel and the Star Player Pine. I mean, well, it was different with Bora because you know he, but he was he's he's strength five with block and mighty blow, so he was the best guy to blitz with, wasn't he? And then, you know, he's the best guy to carry with. Yeah, when you said twelve six, I thought you meant twelve six as the blinds, because that would be like me you would need mega money to play twelve six blinds. Fuck this. I like four tables because, you know, you can split your screen into four pretty easily, can't you? I might stream some poker at weekends. Twenty five fifty. In that case, in that case, you what? You're the richest guy in the world, or the stupidest? <laughs> Twenty five fifty. How much money do you have? Fucking hell. 25.50. How much do you need to even sit down at a table of 25.50? Fucking hell. Oh my god. If I would have to put my entire... I would have to put my entire bankroll in one fucking game. Holy shit. Jesus. 
That's like that's like Vegas money, isn't it? Holy shit! Right, I can't even score now. Can I just go for the dodge or give them two turns? Two turns about the same as one turn anyway. Can't get any kind of chain, can I? What do you mean 25 50 cents? Cuz that would be all right. <laughs> I could handle I could handle 25 50 cents. <laughs> I could I could handle that. I could handle 25 50 cents. <laughs> oh man, sticks tense on the ball. But that's the thing, isn't it? That, you, you know, you would think that tables that were 25.50 would be harder than... Um, you would think 25.50 would be... They would be better players, but really they're not. They're just more richer players that are there. Because, you know, generally the better the people who play fucking all the time aren't that rich, you know? I think I think the, the the you know the people who fucking you know it's fucking hell. Phil Ivy would play it to twenty five fifty wouldn't he probably <laughs> now nah, maybe that'd be low for him. Holy shit! Destronov. Destronov the rich man. Unbelievable. Because like 2550. <laughs> it's a lot. It's just a lot, isn't it? <coughs> <coughs> Gus Hansen, gambling Gus. Yeah, it makes sense because that that's a lot. <laughs> that really like, obviously you know, if you're sitting at home <laughs> and you don't play poker and you think twenty five and fifty dollars isn't a lot to bet, <laughs> the thing is, it gets a lot more than that, very very, very quickly. Lose because I'll blitz the Roger, that seems a good strategy.
get to catch the ball though, maybe. Which would be funny, wouldn't it? <laughs> Gus. Twenty five fifty is a lot for anyone at any time because you just gotta be able to lose so so much in a row, like obviously you could mismanage your money, that's what my friend did. He uh, and like you know, luckily for him he won. Uh but he was he, he was, you know, he was really, he was really fucking taking a risk by playing it, at the level he was playing it. He played stupidly high for what for what he had, uh, but it paid, I mean, he was good. Like I could play it higher than I should, but um, good morning. Mine two tackle zones, pretty good. <laughs> he doesn't have a big hand, but he's got edge five though. One dicer, fucking nails it, prick. He's only gonna have one canoring threat then. <coughs> Realistically, isn't it? I mean, unless he potatoes with the Edge Five wrestle. But then, how can he even? He's got to run all the way around here and dodge through. That's only one scoring threat. All right, great. Famous last words, eh? <coughs> right. He wants to come in here. Cancel that assist. Oh well, what a what a doofus. Oh, he's got sidestep as well. All right, no tense on the uh, on the guy then. You can just still score with him. Fuck. And he did the foul him as well. Him down is barely different to him fucking up. Oh, God. No, he's just going to score, isn't he? Go there for the hope for the one in 36. No, nah, I don't think so.
Yeah, Mr. Yem and Dem. <laughs> VIP, Mr. Yem and Dem. I only realised it after I knocked him down that it was just easy for him to score. So I should have moved him at the end and, and just done something. I don't know what I could have done. Just fouled him, I guess. It was worth fouling him with a beastman somehow. Like, I guess I should have uh, assisted him, then GFI to blitz him, and then fouled him with that beastman. That, that, was, that would have been the play if I'd realised. I just didn't realise. Yeah, that's the thing, Destronov, that's the thing, it's fucking, it's inadvisable to play that much unless you've got, really, a lot. I like a hell of a lot. Holy shit. Because, yeah, it's, I mean, it's easy, you, you could you could play perfectly all day and drop 9k, and then you could play perfectly the next day and drop 9k, and then you could play perfectly the next day and drop 9k. <laughs> you know, that's the fucking thing, isn't it? It's brutal. It can be absolutely brutal. And the worst thing about it is, when you're not making money, you're losing money. That's that's really annoying as well. Yeah, of course he's going to make every roll. I can't believe I fucking didn't realise he was a fucking gutter runner. Just roll some two pluses. What a load of shit. Should have fouled him. Especially as I got the reserves. There you go. Punish for bad play. Yep, I should have just GFI to blitz him. Three dice and then fouled him. And that was the way to go. Needed the foul. Distracted by... By this fucking crazy talk. Holy shit. My mind is... Is honestly blown. Like, obviously they exist. So it shouldn't be crazy that... Like, obviously people play at that level. So it's not... It shouldn't be that crazy that someone... Who likes Blood Bowl... Can afford to play at that level. But it's still crazy, isn't it? It's still crazy to hear it. <laughs> like if somebody watching was like, I'm seven foot tall. I'd be like, holy shit, you're seven foot tall, that's unbelievable. But, <laughs> I mean, you know. <laughs> Fucking hell. Twenty five you can make a lot of playing twenty five fifty cents. <laughs> you know <laughs> that's the thing. <laughs> There's a difference between peasants and uh, and being at the twenty five fifty. Best Fagor is, uh, I don't know where he is. He's just a rookie though, I think. He's got three. Is that him? L Lude Grip is there for sure hands against Wrestle Strip. Best Fagor, there he is. Right, just need him to fill the pick up here. I had the fame. 
<laughs> he had Fun Factor 7. Oh, I guess I've got Fun Factor 6. I had the fame and, and get one I got fucked by that fucking uh, by that blitz result. Could surf him, but not really worth it, is it? As if this guy's fucking safe after he's bought down. What a shithead. Could dodge to hit him. <laughs> At least he's stuck on tents. <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, six, GFI, GFI. Just need one this, just need one here. Oh man. Imagine if he fails the pick up here or just like doesn't go for it or something. Quad skulls or something. If he double, if he double ones the pickup, best fag oh, just runs it in. Ah oh, shit! No, at least he hasn't done casualties yet, anyway. And he bases him. Oh, not. There's going to be a chance to hit the ball here, then, isn't there? Surely. Surely you can't be serious. Come on, strength three tenths, do something. Come on, bastard. Yes, Gabe and R particularly mean the snow guys. That was huge, that wasn't it? That was that was the one keeping him in it. Um one, two, three, four, five, six, GFI, GFI. <sighs> Oh, lucky bastard, though. Oh, what's this, a 5 plus dodge?
Five plus dodge is about as good as I'm going to get. Only hadn't oh if I hadn't moved best if I got he'd scored. <laughs> and I thought about not doing it as well in case the ball went in the crowd. Oh man, best if I got could have just scored. Holy shit. I guess if I hadn't moved people, he wouldn't have taken the wrestle, though. I just thought he wouldn't use wrestle, you know? <laughs> I just literally thought he wouldn't be stupid enough to use wrestle. Um, so I thought I should move everyone first. So, I mean, maybe, like, maybe he wouldn't have been, maybe he wouldn't use wrestle if I had people still to move. So, it probably was. It probably was the right play to move Best Fagor. That would have just landed on his head though if I hadn't moved him. Holy shit. I was like literally, one, two, three, four, five, six. That's exactly where he was, I think. Maybe it was one shot. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. No, no, I think he was here actually. I think he was here. He was there. Yeah, I think he was there, but still, it <laughs> been really close anyway. Yeah, it was fair enough though taking rest legs. It was my last action nearly, wasn't it? But holy shit! I mean, the sad thing basing the lineman and that doesn't really matter, does it? The only thing that matters is his gutters, and he still got them all. Maybe I should have maybe I should have kept uh, best Fagor and like loot grip. Maybe I shouldn't have moved those. He's pretty good this guy though. I'm surprised he's a uh, four two one. Lottery tickets, my only option, Valeni. <laughs> Holy shit. Twenty five fifty. Gambling Gus. Come on, you can fill a three plus dodges, you fuck. I really hate that, because like, you know, Skaven, fair enough, yeah, fair enough, they make all the fucking shithead gutter runner dodges, you expect that, but when they fucking fail, when they pass them as well, it's like, pretty annoying. Two three pluses to two dice the ball. Blitz him. I 
really want to hit him, but then I really want to hit him as well. Knock these two guys down. He could assist up there. Tense on him. Stop him doing anything. And then just punch these guys. Right, just one dice like a boss because why not? Kaz. This lad will one dice this lad. Yeah, it's obviously there's a gaping hole here, isn't there? But then at least if he scores kind of relatively soon, there's a chance to 2-2 two -two it, isn't there? Chance of a Desmond. <laughs> Gaping hole. <laughs> oh, man. There's a chance here. I've seen it. I've seen that there's a chance. Let's see what happens, though. Tense, got him. The only double one is against Tense, what a bastard. He just hasn't failed the three pluses. There's no fucking need for that when he's when he's got a three hundred T V advantage, well two hundred T V advantage. He's just not failing any fucking dodges. Three plus dodges. Fair enough, they're never gonna fail a gotta run a dodge. Fair enough. Wow wow! How'd you even go for that dodge? Oh, you fucking fuck, what the What even is this man? Holy shit. Oh, fuck off.
<laughs> nah, good. Fuck you. Hope he dies. No. So, could have chained him in. Look at that. Could have chained him in, except no, this fuckhead made a 4 plus to fucking 3 plus to get him out. Wow. Wow, fuck this guy, seriously. Meanwhile, I just fucking double skull a block after all that. Fuck off. No rerolls, made every roll. I just, oh man, we're scaven where I look. All right, let me get my bit of paper here. Result doesn't matter. Can't win them all. You can't win them all. I'll write that down, can't win them all. Sometimes the dice are too strong and the TV difference. Lewd grip whip arm just because he's got sure hands against the wrestler strip guy that he had. He's just died. I'm aware that that wasn't the most, the best move in the game. But he knows next turn now, he knows if he stalls, he's getting a big foul on him. Yeah, he kind of a thrower, yeah. Basically, in, I basically induced an orc thrower. <laughs> Yeah, you should have a giant technical for an arm, yeah, that was the that was the original the original player. In both art and uh miniature. He does have six move, which makes him way better than an thrower, yeah. If he was movement five I would never induce him. To be fair. He's playing pretty well though, I think. This Chapapotamus. You just can't win them all, can you? Or any. <laughs> yeah, maybe now. Thank you. 
just doesn't fail. Any three plus. You as well. Chaos Warriors didn't exist in the old floor. Um, he was just like a Chaos Human. Instant reroll of his fucking 4 plus, 3 plus. What the fuck is this guy? Just to make us make a GFI. Right. Blitz him. Clear. Base, base. Hub, dub. Base, base, base. This guy can hit. This guy can enable the chain. This guy can base him. Herp dark, base, base, base. This will fail. I'm on the rig. Herp, herp, herp. Hmm. <laughs> You know, this guy, this fucking guy is making all of his fucking 4 plus 3 pluses and I can't do a fucking 2 dice block without needing to re-roll it. Like, you just ain't gonna win them games, are you? Alright. Alright, let's go with loot grip first. Oh, this guy. Oh, this guy. Ball based. Ball based. <laughs> Tentacles. <laughs> oh shit. Oh, I don't I don't know what the uh, what the bullshit fluff is, to be honest. There's new bullshit fluff now. But the original fluff, he was just a chaos freebooter. More Slanesh than Nurgle. Yeah, Slanesh. Come on, can you fail a 3 plus now? One time. Fail a fucking 3 plus. Come on. Come on. Oh, hey! Alright. Now oh, he's got sidestep. But. <laughs> oh shit. I just gotta go for the pal, haven't I? Fish for the pal. It seems really bad. If I just get the push on him though, then I get the three dice here. So I have to go for the two dice here. I can't believe you've done this. Like, obviously, it makes me make a GFI or a dodge, but um, can Oring Threat go? Right, 
one, two, three, four, five. Dodge GFI to two dice him. I shouldn't have followed, should I? I followed. I thought I could surf him. I was going to try and surf him. Oh, God, I followed. Oh, yeah, make the machine. Yeah. I could have dodged GFI'd surf. No, oh, I can still do it. There's just less to react to it. Yeah, worked out in the end. Got there in the end. The shit thing is that he just two pluses away and gets it. You know? <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Keep him on the tentacles. Yeah, look who's dodging now. They're the only dodges I made in the whole fucking game, though. Come on, fail attempts. Ugh. One dice with wrestle. Hopefully he gets a board down so he can't score. GG noob. Good luck trying to beat a fucking rookie chaos team with fucking two fucking two hundred TV more than this. <laughs> you got pwned by fucking loot grip whip arm. Back of the fucking net. <laughs> oh, he's he's bracketed though. One, two, three, four, five, six. Double GFI handoff. And then he uh, long bombs it to him. Save moves first, this bastard. Nah. Boo. <laughs> Meme grip. <laughs> yeah. 
I caught it as well. Shit. That would have been amazing, wouldn't it? The pass and then catch and then touch down. He actually wouldn't need a long bomb. He could have just done a short pass. Quick pass and then a five plus catch. Just failed some two pluses. But hell, drawing that game was pretty amazing, to be fair. Take that against a, against a Skaven team with that TV advantage. And claw, claw mighty blow. But, uh, yeah, pretty good. Oh, do you know what? I, I actually want to look at the... Let's look at the dodges. Ah, oh, you can't... You don't know what agility was. And that's the dodges done meaningless because you can't see how many three... Can't see how many three plus dodges he did. But he rolled ro loads of dodges with his linos. Fucking hell. Well, succeeded. Rolling them is okay. It's just fucking succeeding them, isn't it? Hmm. Just get hard. God. Like I've got nothing against people like trying things because oftentimes they are the right right fucking move. It's just fucking annoying when they work, isn't it? <laughs> That's the thing. Um, I'm playing more today. Nah, I think that's it, Valley Hop here, to be honest. Um, but yeah, I mean, he he played pretty well, I thought, to be honest. And th and that's the thing. He realised that there was the tense, didn't he? So that's why he made that dodge to blitz rather than just uh, going for the dodge itself and then failed but um funny in it eh what a funny old game so they're unbeaten but it's like being winning five and losing two which isn't isn't very good blodge guard stand firm is a good target for Aurea but I just think blodge isn't as good as block guard and then Blodge guard, you could argue, is better than block guard, stand firm, or block guard, mighty blow. But I think blodge is definitely worse than block guard. Uh, and that's the issue, you know, it's going to take him, you know, 13 more star player points to level up. So I'd much rather have block guard during that time. Like, you struggle most at the lowest TV, you know. Whereas once you get the higher TV, you're golden because you just claw upon the shit out of people. And get automatic 4 0 wins or wins against Ducky, and uh, it's happy days, isn't it? Once you get claw palm. Anyway, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.